Hi, I'm Joel Webster and welcome back to another episode of TRCP's Native Trout Adventures. With me today is Ty Churchwell with Trout Unlimited and Nick Payne, TRCP's Colorado Field Representative. Today we are in southwest Colorado fishing for native Colorado River cutthroat trout in a stream that flows through the Hermosa Roadless area on the San Juan National Forest. Despite the fact that this is the largest unprotected backcountry area in Colorado, it is just a short walk from the truck to find good fishing. Hey guys, this looks like some really nice water right here. We got a big deep run, some good clarity, probably some hungry cutthroats in there. What do you think? Let's go get them. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. It's been a pretty wet and cold spring across much of the West. It's good to find some good weather. So right now it's peak runoff time here in the streams of Southwest Colorado, and we've had to come to some headwater areas way up high to get into some fishable water. It's a little off color for us today, but it's going to work pretty well. These fish are a little bit spooky up here, but uh, we've got an advantage with some dirtier water. There it is. First cutthroat of the day. There's one pretty fish. Let's see what it's. The Colorado River cutthroat trout is native to the upper reaches of the Colorado River and currently exists in parts of Utah, Wyoming, and Colorado. The Hermosa Roadless area not only provides fishing for Colorado River cutthroat trout, it offers some of the best elk and mule deer hunting in the state. Sportsmen have been speaking out about the areas in the state of Colorado that deserve the highest level of safeguards, and Hermosa is one of those that has risen to the top. That one! Little guy. Well, that's my first Colorado River cutthroat trout. Not all that big, but pretty fish. After spending some time downstream, we've decided to work our way up into some smaller water. Good work, Nick. Beauty. Genetically pure Colorado River cutthroat trout. There he goes. Perfect. Almost. Right now, sportsmen are involved in the development of a Colorado roadless rule. This document will control the future of management on more than four million acres of some of the nation's finest public lands, fish and wildlife habitat. How does that feel, Ty? Fabulous. Coloradans sure know the meaning of hospitality. It was a great day, and I just this weather I can't get over how nice it is. Thanks so much. Glad to do it. In order to maintain world-class, publicly accessible hunting and fishing opportunities in the Centennial State, sportsmen like you need to make your voice heard. Can't be today out here. Go to www.trcp.org. Comment on the Colorado Roadless Rule to help safeguard public lands, fishing, and hunting opportunities for all Americans.